Welcome to the UCSF Department of Radiation Oncology. This video is a brief introduction to the SDX breath hold system. One of our goals is to treat the target area with enough radiation and reduce the amount of radiation to other areas as much as possible. For radiation therapy treatments in the chest or abdomen, the standard of care is to treat the patients while they breathe normally. Due to normal breathing motion, a slightly larger area will be treated to ensure that we treat the target disease. For patients who are able to hold their breath for 20 to 30 seconds or longer, we may be able to give the treatment while they're holding their breath. This allows us to reduce the area we are treating and avoid giving treatment to areas that don't need it. It also helps us position the treatment in the same spot each time. The SDX system is a voluntary breath hold system, meaning that the patient is always in control of their breathing. The patient will follow visual cues for their breath hold. The therapist will constantly monitor the patient's breath hold and turn the radiation beam on and off during the process. This video will show what you should expect during your simulation and treatment process. During your treatment simulation, the therapist will introduce you to the CT scanner and the SDX device. You will be helped onto the CT scanner table and the therapist will mold a bag to your body to create a setup of your body position. This bag will form a mold, helping to hold your body in the same setup or position for each treatment that was done for your simulation. The therapist will then show you other parts of the SDX system that you will use. The mouthpiece, the bacterial filter, and the nose clip. The mouthpiece looks like a swimming snorkel or a scuba mouthpiece and is made of soft rubber. You will be asked to place the mouthpiece in your mouth so that it forms a seal and allows your breathing to only occur through the mouth. Both the mouthpiece and the bacterial filter are changed daily. Next, the therapist will ask you to place a nose clip on your nose to assure that you only breathe through your mouth. This allows the system to properly track the volume of air in your lungs. Next, the therapist will give you a set of video goggles which will allow you to see the visual cues that show when you should hold your breath. What you see through the goggles is exactly what the therapist sees as they monitor your breathing. After you are comfortable with these pieces of equipment, the therapist will connect your mouthpiece to the SDX system. Again, you will remain in complete control of your breathing during the entire process. If the treatment area is in your chest, you will hold your breath after inhaling. If the treatment area is in your abdomen, you will hold your breath after exhaling. We will guide you through what you will see for both conditions now. You will see the same screen during simulation and treatment, so we will show you what you will see in the next few minutes of the video. If the treatment area is in your chest, you will hold your breath after inhaling. The therapist will ask you to take a series of normal even breaths. This screen is what you will see during the simulation and treatment. Allow your exhalations to fall within the middle of the gray band on the screen. Once the therapists are ready for you to hold your breath, the green light will turn on. This green light indicates to you to take a deep breath in and hold your breath within the green band for a certain period of time. You'll see a timer showing how long you hold your breath. During the simulation, we will determine approximately how long you can hold your breath. When the red light turns on, that indicates to you to start breathing normally until the therapists are ready for the next breath hold. If at any time you are unable to comfortably hold your breath, Resume normal breathing and the therapist will turn off the radiation beam and allow you to breathe normally. They will continue your treatment when you are ready. If the treatment area is in your abdomen, you will hold your breath after exhaling. Most of the processes are the same, except when the green light turns on, you will take a deep breath in and exhale, then hold your breath within the green band for a certain period of time. We hope this preview gives you a good sense of what to expect during your simulation imaging and treatment. Don't hesitate to ask any questions or share concerns with your medical team.